welcome to my channel it's been long since i said that but i am back i know i was gone for a while forgive me i just honestly didn't feel like making videos which isn't a good excuse but i'm back guys i am back so today's video is going to be a get ready with me video i don't know why i'm smiling so much maybe because the quality looks amazing i think the sunlight and ooh, yeah i don't know why i'm smiling so much so excuse me but i hope this happiness rubs off on you so anyways today's video is going to be a get ready with me and sort of like a little get to know me but i really i didn't really talk about myself much because every time i do my makeup I don't really talk so it, I forgot to talk to you guys. I hope you do click the subscribe button if you're new to my channel and if you're old you are the realist like you are you are loyal you're the type of person everyone needs in their life because you are loyal because I know I haven't been doing my part but thank you so much so let's get on to the video yeah <laughs> I'm just honestly so bubbly today like I don't know so we're going to start off with a fresh face. So I'm going to start off with my primer. This is the Rimmel Stay Matte Primer. I always use this. It's awesome. Under $10. And it keeps you matte too. If you are new to my channel, well thank you for subscribing and thank you for watching. So today's look is just going to be like a simple sort of matte makeup look. Well I don't know yet. I might change my mind but we're just going to do something simple and you know basic for summer and sorry for the background noise um yeah family's watching tv yeah so sorry for any extra outside noise that you hear so i'm gonna apply my foundation which is the nyx matte foundation as you can see i use a lot of matte products oh dang i actually don't want to do my foundation I'm gonna do my eyebrows. I lied, not foundation. Eyebrows next. I need to sharpen my eyebrows. And I can't find my. <gasps> I found it! It was here the whole time. Y'all, I have been looking for this stupid sharpener and it was here the whole time. Wow. Don't you just hate it when like you look for something and you can't find it, but then you find it because it was just right there? Well, I'm amazed. So as you can see, I don't really have any, I've, so I haven't really planned out um, what I'm going to say to you guys, but I just want to talk about, um, well, I just want to give you guys a life update, sort of like a channel, uh, and like a channel update, because I have been gone, and I haven't been making videos consistently, so I just wanted to talk about that, you know. I haven't been posting videos lately, and it's because I've been feeling unmotivated, like I just didn't feel like making videos. It was just like a weird, um, like a weird feeling because I'd come on my channel every time. I'm like, oh, look at my old videos and stuff. And of course, when people comment on my videos and they subscribe, I get a notification. So I saw all of that, but I just did. I don't know. I just it was just a random feeling because I do like making videos. And I do like, you know, recording myself and stuff. And I do like just being me behind the camera. But, I don't know, I just felt empty. So I went ahead and I did my eyebrows and foundation off camera. Because it took me so long. Like, I just had to teach myself how to do my eyebrows again. Because they definitely need to be groomed. So excuse my eyebrows. They don't look good. But we're just going to roll with this. I'm going to go ahead and conceal. And I'm going to use the... MAC Studio Finish Concealer in NW50. I just got this. I haven't been feeling motivated to film videos. And it was not just with YouTube. It was just like with everything. I just didn't feel like doing anything. I don't think I want to contour, so I'm just going to put a little bit. I was getting a bit discouraged by other YouTubers because of course I also watch other YouTubers and just how 
their channel was growing. I just felt like my channel wasn't growing. I just felt like my videos were just pointless and boring and had like nothing meaningful. Um, yeah, so basically I was comparing myself to others and you know how that goes. Every time you compare yourself to others, it just brings you down because of course, you know, everyone is at a different um, stage in life. Everyone is at a different level in life, you know. Some people are successful, they have everything together. You know, some people are also starting fresh. You know, I just felt like a nobody, <laughs> basically. Like, just be honest with you guys. And funny enough, even though, like, I wasn't making videos, people were still subscribing, people were still commenting on my videos. And so, I kind of felt like, how should I say it? Not guilty, but I was like, dang, like, you know, people actually watch my face with the black opal powder in the shade medium well I'm not setting my face I'm just setting my highlight This powder, it's um, dark deepest and it's the max skin finish. I'm going to use that to set my smile lines because that part always creases. What I was trying to say before is that, yeah, I realized that some people are like so big on YouTube, they have so many subscribers and whatnot, but at the same time, they're not me. I came across like a quote, I don't know if I heard it on TV or something, but it was about how um, there's enough room for everyone to grow. There's, you know, enough room. Oh, it was another YouTuber. That's what I think it was. It was another YouTuber. I think she was talking about how there's enough um, room for everyone to be a YouTuber. Like if you want to be a YouTuber, do it. Like don't worry about the subscribers and whatnot. Like just do what you love to do. Just, you know, do you basically <laughs> that's what i'm trying to say because even aside from youtube that made me think about other things in the past that i've wanted to try but i just felt like oh a lot of people are already doing this so why would i you know do it what's what's going to be new when i do it because a lot of people are already doing this but the thing is that no matter what everyone is doing even if you are doing the same thing you bring a different meaning to it like you bring a different vibe to it yeah so i just realized that there's enough room in this world for you to be whatever you want to be even if someone is doing the same thing and they are succeeding if you know they're getting so much um, attention it doesn't matter just keep doing you and eventually your light is also going to shine eventually God is also going to lift you up and they might be doing it for the wrong reasons but because of your good heart and because you're doing something that you love that God is just going to make a way like he's gonna lift you up so this doesn't only apply to YouTube it applies to anything in your life if you feel like you want to do something but you just think oh you're not good enough or like you like you just can't do it because other people do it better don't don't limit yourself do what you want to do do it from a good heart and yeah <laughs> that was my motivational moment let's get on to this makeup oh I also have to set my eyes I forgot to set my eyes my eyelids, not my eyes. Any eyeshadow? I don't feel like wearing eyeshadow, so I'm gonna do my eyeliner. And this is a challenge for me. I don't really like to do eyeliners because I just always mess up. Like, I do the side and it'll be so perfect, like so sharp. And I'm like, yes, I finally did it. And then I tried on this eye and then it is a hot mess.
highlight with my Ruby Kisses highlighter. It's actually broken. Do y'all hear my mom in the background? Always, always making the noise up trying to film the video. <laughs> Hi guys.